hello in this video we are going to see how exactly we are going to import a csv file so in order to import a csv file first of all you have to put the csv file in the import directly so wherever your neo4j path is so see what exactly is the path in the database location in my database it's c drive users user doc documents neo4j default or graph db wherever whatever is this database location you go to that location within graph.tv create a import folder and then put your csv file here this is my csv file and this is how it looks so it's taking some time to open so uh, if in this file you have to have header as source target and whatever is the uh, weight of the edge so uh, in this particular file we have got three columns the first column is the source column the second column is the target column and the third target is the distance column that is the distance between the source and the target so once you have uh, opened this file uh, see how exactly the relationships are structured in this particular file so close this and Some item I am not able to open it. Uh, there is some problem here. Uh, okay, so this is a CSV file. We will have a look at it again. Um, so here, uh, so here you enter this command. Enter this command. Load CSV with headers from file as line. So here don't put file as this path just put test.csv uh, because if you put here the path name uh, the configuration file you have to make certain changes in the configuration files uh, if you want to avoid making changes in the configuration file just let so as load csv with headers from file c drive slash test.csv c drive slash test.csv don't write coursera slash data just write file colon slash 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 c drive so just write uh, so here just write load csv as line as test c drive dot test dot csv what will happen this file will be automatically picked from your import folder and then uh, these are the three nodes that you must specify here you are in this particular node in these files in this particular you are asking that n is the node and the node type is my node uh, the property uh, it has got uh, so this the entire the entire csv is loaded as in a, in a variable line so the name is whatever is the name of the source and then merge every node with line dot target so line is the variable here and target is the header name in the csv file then we are defining the relationship this is for merging the sources this is for merging the targets and this is for merging the relationship so relationship is colon to dist that is distance that is a variable name or the property name that i am giving this is a line that this is the line is a variable name here the distance and it is linking to the target this is how the relationship is defined so copy this and execute it here copy it straight away like this and then when you execute it here see 11 11 labels are created and 11 nodes are created 25 properties are created that and of 20, 14 relationships are created in 186 milliseconds so if you want to see how exactly your graph looks like so here here is the graph this exactly it looks let's see if we can open the excel here so go here and try to open so this is how the excel file looks this is source this is the target and this is this is the distance so you must be aware of how exactly is your information schema model in your uh, file and what what kind of the nodes that you would like to create thank you